Good morning and welcome to United World Capital Daily Market Reviews. Today in the morning we can see that the stock markets, the trading of the raw materials and currencies are moving in the uh, multi-directions. Mainly the most important data which were coming today in the market this morning, it has been the PMI index uh, coming from China. Traditionally, this index is represented by two institutions, the official uh, Chinese regulator and the independent HSBC bank. It's necessary to mention that both numbers which were uh, presented became to be a bit uh, better than the analytics were predicting. HSBC presented the PMI index on the level of 49.50 and the Chinese regulator stated the official numbers of 50.2. Maybe it's necessary to explain that the numbers uh, of this index which are bigger than 50 are considered positive and uh, this uh, states and discovers about the uh, good development in the production sphere of the country. This obviously gave some kind of emotional boost to the markets which we uh, could see the expressed in the development of the index which adds this morning 1.8 percent. But uh, at the same time it's necessary to state that um, this data might be important in the long-term direction as well because it can um, say that the Chinese economy starts to recover and the measures which were taken by the Chinese government were quite successful. Also at the same time Investors were really uh, waiting then the trading sessions in the United States are going to be opened and yesterday at the opening we could see the very positive developments um, on the main um, stock indexes in the, of the United States. Unfortunately a bit later the dynamics have been changed and the S&P 500 index reaching the level of 1418 started to decrease and the moods of the investors have uh, changed uh, more to a negative uh, dynamics and the index has closed its trading session just a bit above 0.02 percent. Nasdaq also have uh, closed the session in the uh, green zone but Dow Jones unfortunately have been losing um, a bit more than 0.06 percent. Uh, this morning as well, unfortunately, the prices of oil um, are moving in the different way and the brand is losing at price comparable to uh, yesterday. And the brand is traded uh, this morning on a level of $107.36 per barrel. Numax is uh, moving positively and it's traded on a level of $85.68 per barrel meaning what we spread between two types of oil is increasing this morning. Um, at the same time, it's uh, also interesting to follow up the prices of the precious metals because the gold is adding 0.4% uh, comparable to yesterday and it's traded this, this morning at the levels of $17.19 uh, per troy once. Uh, we can expect that um, the, uh, dec uh, the decrease which we could see in the oil prices last week, it, uh, could, it most probably was the technical correction uh, to the growth which we could see before. Uh, so most probably the pr uh, precious metal prices are going to continue its positive development and we uh, will see uh, much better uh, levels in the ne nearest future. Uh, today it's the day, it's another one day full of statistics and full of the macroeconomic data coming from the different countries and uh, one of the most important is also the ADP numbers uh, uh, on unemployment figures which we will be presented in the afternoon. Uh, hopefully these figures will give us some kind of expectation so what figures of unemployment we are going to see uh, tomorrow. I wish you a very good trading day. Thank you.